This is Bulgizel Ski Jump Stadium where Olympics were hosted. An incredible place in Innsbruck, Austria. And this is a must watch vlog till the end. What the hell? When ski jumper jumping from this location, first thing what he sees in front is this graveyard. Wow, this is too scary. Welcome to my channel. So good to see you all. So in my last video, we went to Swaraski and because of the time we spent there, I'm putting this in a second video. Now it's almost at three o'clock here. Uh, we have very less time to go to Innsbruck and uh, from here uh, it will take us around half an hour to reach to Innsbruck and you guys keep watching this video because you're gonna have wonderful time. We can try in a crowd, we never hesitate Let us rise through the clouds We got nothing to lose, I know the time is right Let us light up the fuse So we'll reach to Innsbruck city, right? Yes, it's beyond the way to, to the city center And I don't give it up without a fight What I feel, what I feel, I know it's right So the building which we are seeing on the top of the mountain is called Bergizel Ski Jump Area. Olympics were hosted here and this is a symbolic building for Innsbruck. Bergizel area has an excellent location. From there we see panoramic view of the city. And this is the place which we are going to visit. And to visit this place we have to climb the mountain. So this is going to be super exciting. Dark chocolate to kill the hunger? Of course, since morning we didn't get anything. Marco is not allowing us to eat anything. Should we take our apples? We have three apples. So this is the apple. Oh. This is our lunch. Yeah. This is your lunch. Thank you, Apple Man. You know, Adam and Eva. Adam and Eve. So God sent them to earth because they had an apple in the heaven. And God will send this guy to hell. From Earth for eating this apple. So we have to do some hiking to reach to the top of the mountain. There's such a beautiful atmosphere here. Manas is almost tired. Take care, Manas. We have almost climbed this much. Come on, Manas, you can do it. Marco is so fast, yeah. He says Indians are slow. Let's show him we are not slow. Manas, Bolo. Lakesh. How you are feeling now? What are your thoughts? Antabulous. Antabulous? Yes. <laughs> Manas, don't die just, please. Would you believe this is just 3.14 p.m. and it almost looks like 6 o'clock. Somehow clouds are back. Look at those mountains. I wanted to go on these mountains but because we do not have sufficient time, we came to this place. I have reached. This is scary. To some extent, he's also scared too because he's standing on the top of the mountain and he's not married yet and he's eating apple also for the last time. <laughs> last red, red My color. last dish. Yeah. Last dish. <laughs> <laughs> so, we are finding a girl for Marco already. Yes. We have announced in my last video mm -hmm. that if any girls are there who are so, looking so. for eligible bachelor, <laughs> yeah, then so they can so contact me. <laughs> I'm not sure if you can see the small river there. That is the Innsbruck city. And as I say, all the mountains in the background. Perfect view. We are going there. 
Netflix. So this is what happens when you don't know how to reach to a place, you ask for a direction. But the irony is the person whom they are asking how to reach there, she has also lost her way. Okay, now see this. Marco and Manas has decided to go from the right side, wherein other people are going from the left. But this is totally confusing. I hope we are on the right track. So we wanted to visit Bag Eagle Mountain, but somehow it is closed uh, as it is Sunday. So this guy, whenever he is with us, uh, like last time we were in Eagle Nest and it was also closed and we couldn't go there. So this time also the same thing happened. So Manas, what do you want to say? No comment. Yeah, Panwati. <laughs> it was unfortunate because this particular uh, thing is closed now. This sky, what is that? Bird Gizel, uh, sky, what is that? My name, Marco? It's called the Beak Gizel Shop. So this place is closed because it's Sunday, and uh, but still it was a good walk here. It's a trekking. A small, small, maybe uh, yeah, 10 minutes totally. walk. Oh, yes. 10 minutes walk, man? Come on, for you it could be 10 minutes. You are running, man. Yes. 10 minutes. For us it is half an hour. So, Marco, where are we going now? Now we are heading towards the, the, the stadium, the back easel jump. Okay. And then let's take a snapshot over there before we decide what we do next. So, Marco, I have a question. It could be a silly question. So, tell me, in autumn when these leaves fell down from the trees, who cleans them? Nobody. Nobody. Nature. Nature. Yes. Wow. In India, what people can do is leaves ko jama karte aur usme aag laga dete. Haan. Aur usme log apna haath sekte. Daru ke saath. Deja vu. Netflix ka apna hero. See this city view. See, he made us sweat. Oh. He is uh, almost, I think, uh, seven years older than you. Marco, what is your age? You want to reveal on the camera your age? Oh. <laughs> uh, what is your age? Me? I am alien, man. I don't have age. <laughs> We don't grow old. Yeah. Yeah. Only my beard grows. Okay. Up these ski chambers uh, up to the jump to the top, uh -huh. and then they will jump down. So in winter, this all the mountains are covered with the snow. Everything looks white. Yeah. So the ski chamber jumps down, and this is the city full of snow in front of you. Mm. I think for the ski jumper, it's the problem to concentrate himself on the jump itself mm. rather than enjoying the view. Marco, I think we can go up and go. Yes, I think so. Wow, so this place is open with 9.50 euro entry fee. But the problem is this place is open till 4.30 p.m. And right now the timing is 4 o'clock. So let's see if they allow us to enter inside the stadium or not. I am so excited now because we got our tickets. So let's go in and see how this stadium looks from the inside. 1964 or 1976 Winter Olympics were held. Okay, so this is the main entrance for this stadium and not the mountain way which we were trying earlier. I think they have some road for the staff from there. And you know the funniest part? This gate is much closer to our parking. Yes, you heard it right. But nevertheless, we had so much of fun climbing that mountain and walking in the jungle. And uh, when the ski jumper is jumping down, so the crowd is uh, shouting, See! It's full! So until the end of the jump, and then the ski jumper is jumping. 
What the hell? When ski jumper jumping from this location, first thing what he sees in front is this graveyard. Wow, this is too scary. We are going to the top with this lift. So are you ready to see the perfect view? Let's go. As I was saying, this place gives panoramic view of Innsbruck city, as you can see behind me. And Manas and Marco both are enjoying in this place. Yes, we thought it is closed, it's Sunday, but we were lucky enough to get this opportunity to come to this place, otherwise we would have missed this beautiful view. And we feel like birds now because we are flying over the valley. Yeah. Amazing place, Marco. Yeah, very and huge. Yes, complete city center here, or there, the main station, the stadium, the speed jump, the highway. And there, this lake, this is used uh, to produce the snow and the ice for the speed jump over there, the lake over there. Let's see what we have at the other side. So this is the back side of this place where you can see the mountains behind. So basically this city is covered by all the mountains. See that is the place where we clicked all the photos. How it looks from here. Fantastic. Okay, so here is the suggestion, while going down, please use the staircase because you're going to see Bergizel history on the walls. This is something really interesting. So finally, our day comes to an end here and uh, from here we will be heading back to Munich. It was a hectic day. Uh, we are tired but still have energy left with us and uh, except this guy. <laughs> so, but really, we, uh, we had a wonderful day. So first of all, thank you, Marco for having us here in Austria. That's been a road trip. And thanks to Ryan for this uh, videography. And hopefully the viewers will like your channel. Thank you. And keep enjoying Sahil video. Yeah. Give us a like. Yeah. yeah. So guys, if you like this video, please hit that like button and hit that red subscribe button below. Thank you so much. I hope you will enjoy this video. Bye. Bye. Welcome to yet another exciting and beautiful day from Prague. So basically this protest is against the government. Uh, so now we are going to buy the ticket and we are going to climb on this tower. See? Shortcut! You will get more viewership.